What's up, Gooners? Today, I'm gonna be doing a tier list for Frank Ocean Blonde. Nikes is a freaking S, dude. Production is off the charts, man. Like, such a captivating listen, bro. Like, there's nothing, I can't say anything bad about, like, shit like this, man. Like, just like the last 30 seconds of this song, dude. Like, I cannot imagine making this. Like, that's how good it is. Like, I, it's an S plus, S plus, bro, S plus. Ivy is also an S. Vocals here are actually, like, incredible. Like, I just, I don't know, dude. Like, it's so addicting. Like, I just, there's nothing else to say S to you. Pink and white is a C. Now you might be thinking, how the frick could you give that a C? Uh, I think I've just overplayed it. I've, I've listened to this song too much. Um, but don't get me wrong. There are some great parts to this. Like, there are some incredible parts to this track. I mean, like, in terms of all music, like, it's an S tier. But for Blonde, I'm giving it a C. Be Yourself is an S tier. Um, I just love this. I love this shit, dude. It's the, it's the, it's the, it's the, it's the, it's the instrumental in the background, man. Like, the, int the that sample, that sample work, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just, it's just masterful work here by Frank. Uh, yeah, S tier. Solo. Solo. Uh, solo is an A. It's almost an S. It's almost an S, but it's an A. Skyline 2 is a B because... I don't think it's like quite up there with like the greatest songs on this album. I really like the song name though. Like it just fits, it fits with the album, man. Like it's just, it's so like thematic. I just love this shit, man. But, uh, sonically, I don't think it's as good as the rest of the album, so. But it's still a great song. Like it's still great. B, B, B2. Self control is an A. And you're probably wondering why is this not an S? Like, come on, like this has to be an S. Uh, it's because it was the first song that I really got into off of Blonde, and I like listened to it so much. I, like at the time, I thought it was an S, but the more I listened to Blonde, like the more I realized that I th I don't think it's like S tier Blonde, but it's close. There are S there are S tier parts of this song, so I'm going to give it an A. Though. Good guys, an A tier. It's a simple song, but it smacks, bro. It smacks. I love this. I love it. I love you, Frank Ocean. So yeah. Um, it's just really short, so that's why it's not an S, but I think for what it is, it's amazing. It's an A. Knights is an S tier. That's it. Knights is an S. Uh, solo reprise is an A. Um, Andre 3000, though. Incredible. Like, hats off. I love Andre 3000. The imagery here, I, I can, I can see this song. I can see it. Um, solid A tier. Though. Pretty sweet. For me, for me, this is a D tier. I just, for some reason, I just don't like it as much as the other songs. I don't know, man. It's just like the one song off of Blonde that I wasn't like blown away by. So, uh, it's a D tier. Uh, Facebook story. A. I love it. Sample again. The sample hits. Dude, it hits, man. The guy who's like voicing it over, bro, like. I can feel what he's feeling, you know what I'm saying? That's why Blonde is a great album, I can feel it. That's an A tier, that's an A tier. Close to You is a B tier. That's literally like all I have to say about it. Uh, great sample work, great production. It's a B tier. All right, Why Ferrari is an S. There is no possible way this song could not be an S, okay? I will say, it's a slow listen. Like, you have to be patient to listen to it, but that's why it's good. Like, once you get past the fact that it's like a very slow paced, paced song, you realize that it is like the S of all S's. Like, it's just a great, it is a great song. Okay, S tier. Siegfried, also an S, the instrumental. Fucking priceless. Like, literally the modern day equivalent to a Renaissance painting. S tier, baby. Godspeed, A. Godspeed is an A. When I first started listening to it, like the first couple of listens were probably an S tier, but I think like, like the first like minute 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 30 is worthy of an s i think it kind of just like fizzles out towards the end but it really is a great song like it's still incredible it's still an a tier song if you sure a free s tier it perfect it's a perfect ending to the album well, like, i literally have never like it's one of those songs where you just have to like almost cry every single time it just taps into like that humanity like that nostalgic like sad feeling you know what i'm saying Especially like the production, the vocals, everything. Perfect in the album. Let's go.